hello guys i am back again still updating you with what is going on in nigeria so good morning good afternoon and good evening depending on your location at this time of the day okay guys um we already know what is going on next year is 2023 election and nigerians are calling for a better future uh, for themselves a better future for their children and a better future for their grandchildren Okay, um, there is a lot of reaction with what you are seeing on your screen right now. As this um, uh, COP member, NYSC pass out member, dedicated his certificate. Okay, let me not say certificate, his future, yes, to Tinibu. Now, um, they say, why well, are they like church projects? You know, they have only finished. There is a lot of reaction with this. So I quickly want to share this with you. Uh, to also have your contribution on the comment section below or maybe one word for this guy now look at the placard the placard says i dedicate this certificate to god and asiwa jubola ametinibu for his forthcoming victory asiwa ju lokan 2023 i am batified Okay, so that is what is here in the placard day. So the first thing that came into my mind is, as in, why is this guy doing this? Is it for personal purpose or is it maybe let him, you know, uh, chasing cloud to train at the end of the day, get, um, I don't know how to say it, get the opportunity, you know, to be close to Tinibu, but that is by the way. Everyone has their own personal reason for doing things. But uh, let me quickly give you the reaction of some Nigerians. According to uh, Mwokbo, someone here said, it's only a youth without future and good vision will do that. You don't dedicate it to God or your parents that train you. This is stomach infrastructure youth. Of course, your parents spend a lot of money, train you in the university sometimes because I don't think this guy spent only four years in the university. I've forgotten if there is, I don't think for past years, nobody has completed a four year course in Nigerian university, that four years. I'm not even talking about carryover, all right? I am talking about strike. Somebody will spend five, six years for a four year course. Okay, look at what is going on right now. Asu is on strike close to four months or more than four months now. And this is a person still calling. I, I, I don't know what to say to this guy, okay? I want you to put in your contribution on the comment section below. So another person here says, not your parent who trained you. Of course, it looks more like it is not his parent that trained him or whatsoever because I don't see if a reasonable youth like this. Of course, I don't know if there is any reasonable youth after everything now dedicating his certificate to uh, Bola Tinibu as the next incoming president the same administration where hardship i maybe the guy doesn't understand after the 33000 naira monthly uh, when he misses the 33000 naira monthly uh, coming back to the wall and stay about 5 years 6 years without a good paying jobs that is when he will understand. Of course, in Nigeria, you see people graduate uh, working in some places that they pay less than 30,000 naira. How do they survive? Many people, the minimum wage, the take home pay cannot even take them home again, like seriously. And you ask a question, how do these people survive? And this guy, for, as in, I stand to be corrected. I keep telling you guys, anybody have the right to vote whosoever their conscience wants. Simple. So, uh, Mickey, someone here said uh, you want to use your hypocrisy to cash out by trying to show solidarity with the same people who wants to ensure you do not have a future. You try well, well. It's the same administration. Of course, this person is right. You are showing solidarity to the same administration that 
you have seen it. It's not as if this guy is blind or he doesn't know what is going on, what is trending in Nigeria, the hardship. According to Buhari, his um, uh, message today, okay, that is Salah message today, Buhari says that he knows what Nigerians are facing. That means Nigerians is facing hardship. Yes. Buhari says he knows what Nigerians are facing, that he, the administration is trying their best to resolve it. It therefore means Nigerians is facing things, is facing hardship. Before Buhari should say, he knows. That means it is happening. And this is a guy showing solidarity to administration that already know that they are facing hardship. So another person said, um, not to your parent, we, well, we understand there is no job. Of, of course, if you see the rate of unemployment in Nigeria, as in, even if you're opportune to work with connection, and even with the connection, how much is a monthly salary, even with a connection in a good company? Now, couple with the fact that, um, you know, prices of commodity going up almost on a daily basis. Okay, guys, um, just one word for this guy. I quickly want to share this with you. If you have anything to contribute, uh, put it down in the comment section below. See you guys in another update.